So it's actually been a couple weeks since I filmed this video. Shocker! We're trying. We're living, laughing, loving, and we're trying. And I know I'm uploading it a day late. I usually upload on Sundays, but yesterday was the two year of my sister passing away and Walt was with me and I don't know, I just didn't really take the time to edit this week, but I did it all today. That's what you're about to see. And every single thing that I unboxed and used will be linked below in the description. I've literally been in bed editing the entire day, so that's why I look so good. But yeah, my house is slowly but surely coming together. It's actually come together a lot since this video that you're watching. I'm already editing the next one because I don't want to keep waiting this long. Um, and I want to keep keeping y'all up to date, but I'm gonna still try and keep them in order. While I was editing, I realized like I showed you the process, but didn't really show you the end result to some stuff. So I'm about to film it and add it in here. <laughs> My house is just a mess right now, kind of, sort of, just a little bit, I don't know why. So I'm gonna do my best, but I hope you guys enjoy and if you're moving, good luck. It's a good time, it's really exciting. Bye.
Um, I should probably clear the boxes up though, so that I can really see what all I have. Uh, this is, looks like so much fun. I already like broke down half of them though, so, uh, and cleaned up a lot. I don't have that much more to go. But, oh, I can't wait to just like lay it all out and like see what I fucking have. <laughs> boxes I need to break down. These are some of the little mugs that I got on Amazon. I've been seeing them. They've been in my storefront for so long, but I just never had the room for them. And yeah, they're just little plastic. I got one, two, three, four, five, six of them. I don't remember what pack they came in. Oh my God, I'm so sunburned. Look at where I wear my goggles. Look, it's so bad. Okay, anyways, yeah. <laughs> You can't tell how many cardboard boxes this is, but it's bad. I lost a shoe. What do I do with them? Make them go. Okay, so my friend Lauren surprised me and sent me, don't look at that, sent me a like housewarming gift from Amazon and she told me to open it and I was like, no, I'm gonna open it in my video. So let's open it. This looks like it's a tray. A decorative art tray. Slay. Here, let me just first get it. I'm about to run out of memory, but. I don't know why I'm nervous. This makes me nervous, Lauren. None of my actual friends watch my YouTube, but I know that she does. So, I know she's watching. She's a real one. Isn't that kind of sad though? Like none of my friends like really watch my video. Like, okay, fuck you. I'm just kidding. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. <laughs> By the way, this is the girl that made that TikTok about Walt and was like, don't worry about it, sweetheart. You see my everything once too. And it was a joke and everyone freaked out because they thought it was Walt's ex-girlfriend. Oh my God, girl. What is, what is this? What is that? Oh. Oh. We got glass. Oh, shout it. What is it? Oh, they're little like aesthetic glasses. These look like, like anthropology. Is this a vase? I think it's a vase. <gasps> okay, that's what I thought it did. Or maybe it's not supposed to do that. But I think that this is like that thing that you put by your bed. Or am I making that up? To like pour water? We'll figure it out. Thanks, queen. Love you, bitch. Don't follow her. Just kidding. You can if you want. Okay, and she got me a cutting board. A cutting board to cut my tomatoes and my cheese for my caprese. I'm not even in the frame. Thank you, girl. I was actually gonna throw my cutting board out. I need a new one, so slay. Wait, that's what this is for, right? I'm hopeless with the kitchen, but I won't be now. Thank you. I'll link these below. I'll find them somehow. I'll link them for y'all. Thanks, slay, bitch. Love. Okay, I have an ice maker, but this is a round. These are round ice cube trays. And just let me have my moment. I like the look of round ice. It's cute. Let me just show you, okay? Oh! There they are. The art of mixology. They just look cuter in your drinks, like literal circle, circles of ice. <gasps> and a little thingy boop. Ah! I'm screaming, I love it. You'll get the vision, I'll insert a clip and you'll be like, oh. Okay, this is the, what do you call it? Utensils that I bought, um, I'll link them below. Why do I look like a red tomato? Oh, it looks like a shit. Um, we're gonna do that, okay. But yeah, um, I invested in these because last time I got ones on Amazon and they, they came just like, they looked dirty and used and I even washing them couldn't get rid of that look. So I was just invested in these. These were from Pottery Barn, I believe. And 
they're so slay and so cute. Like the little white thing. I love them. They are a bit pricey, but I'm currently using plastic forks and knives. And I'm reusing them. I don't know if you've watched my previous vlogs, people literally will come and be like, Christy, why are you washing in the dishwasher plastic forks? And I'm like, because I'm a hoarder and I don't like to get rid of things. Or we can just say I'm saving the environment. Either works. Either works. I feel so fancy. I feel like a grown ass adult. Am I ever gonna stop dressing like this though? Like I literally look like a child. Look at this. <laughs> One thing at a time, babe. One thing at a time. It actually is funny though because I bought bamboo things on Amazon. I didn't measure because why would I measure? And they're not big enough. <laughs> so right now I have nothing to put these in other than just flat out laying them in here. Uh, but we will fix that soon. And I will update you with that. So I'm literally straight up just gonna be placing these in here. on Amazon and I'm LOLing because they literally feel like they're they should be like 99 cents they literally are paper like something that you'd get in a goodie bag at a kid's birthday party but also like slay <laughs> I forgot I ordered these I'll put them below <laughs> if you want it but like I'm just telling you I'm gonna sit on these motherfuckers they'll be gone I don't think they're pricey though so it's a good thing oh gotta be gentle okay So this is the before of my vanity. I'm almost positive that I'm not keeping this, but I am gonna go through and clean it all out because I mean, just like look at it, it's self-explanatory. So first things first. First things first, usually I am going to take everything out, put it on the floor and then sort it from there. So this is really so much fun and such a blast. Oh my God, I'm having the time of my life you guys, like I literally can't. I can't control my excitement. I'm having a blast. All right, let's speed this up. Okay, next up, I'm gonna sort through and organize this. Fun!
freaking believe this. I, it's 1.30 in the morning. This took so fucking long. Was I rushing? No. Did I take way too long doing it? Yeah. I think I'm done for the most part. Look at this little, this is all some nail, DIY nail stuff that I don't use, but if I ever end up needing it, um, I did a brand deal with them and I just get my nails done now, but if I ever like have a period of time where I stop, this is what I would use because I really enjoyed it. But put that all together there because it was literally just thrown. So let me really quickly like go over what we have here. Okay, so in this bin right here, I have all my mascaras. Remember that I wiped every, ew, my toes. Y'all, no. Remember that I wiped them all down, so oh my god, my camera battery's about to die, of course. So my ma mascaras, these are lip lipsticks, sunscreen, lip glosses, primers, my powder, press whatever setting powder. This is highlight bronzer, um, eyeshadow palettes, eye stuff, which is glue and eye drops. This is um, spray, makeup spray, setting spray. Um, I have my concealers and my foundation. This is kind of like miscellaneous eyebrow. Um, this is my blush, eyeliner, sponges, and eyeshadow. I mean, and eyelashes. And my camera's about to die. And then I have all my brushes over here I'm about to wash. And this is like a knickknack thing I have to go through. I'm gonna have another one with lotions and my camera is literally about to die. But I'm gonna put it in there, charge my camera up a little bit and update you. <laughs> which is a kitchen wrap organizer. It's like a little acrylic organization thing for all the like Ziploc baggies and like tin foil and all that stuff. So it'll just make it look neater and cuter. That's what we're striving for here, babe. Ugh. Okay. Oh, oh my Lord and Jesus. Through the day, I hope this fucking fits in my drawer because I don't measure because I'm stupid. I just order things and I'm stuck with them and returning it is a bitch. Let's try. Fingers crossed. Oh my god, it fits. Fucking fits. I knew it. I fucking knew it. <laughs> for my bathrooms. I have three bathrooms now, so I have no excuse for running out of storage. But I've got all my acrylic things and I'm going to organize the bathroom. I'm gonna try. So I have this entire box filled of shit. I've got that elastic PR all stuck in there. I've got, oh, oh, this, this, one more box in there. I just, it's a, more stuff in there. It's a lot, but I got some acrylic things and we're gonna get to town in this little nook.
lived in, I've never had a vacuum. I have like a really shitty hand vacuum from like TJ Maxx or something. Mm, doesn't really work. You probably saw me use it. Anyways, no you didn't. Um, so I got the Dyson vacuum. Um, shout out to my mother for gifting it to me as a housewarming gift. I think. Yeah, I don't know why there's so many pieces to it, but like it asked me if there was like an extra option that I wanted to add. Like I got like a spare part and I chose the car one, the car vacuum, because my car's disgusting. I eat in there. I got crumbs everywhere. You don't see me eat. Anyways, let's unbox these hoes. Yeah! I guess I'll do this first, right? Right, 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 right. Box. Okay. Going down. Treat my things very gent gently. Lots of handled care. Lots of care to be given. Handled. <laughs> hey. They really protected this hoe, didn't they? Take it. Oh. Hey. What are you? Yeah. I don't know what I'm doing. There. Lay through the day. things at Disney. <laughs> I thought you had to like charge it or something first. Damn. this thing that I got to catch bugs because I have so many flies and I had someone come spray. Ooh, I have like little, whoa, hello? Little baby flies. What is happening? There we go. I have like little baby flies all up in here and I just see new ones every day dead. So I need to figure out how to do that. I look amazing. I look really cute. I look fucking terrible. Um, it's gonna look better. This is temporary. Here I have my lotions, perfumes, this is a little eyelash, like eyelash extension thing. This is face stuff under eye patches. And all this is my facial skincare that I use. Down here we have makeup removers, rags, and my towels go here. I'm not obsessed with this. The original stuff that I bought doesn't fit under my sink. Like I told y'all before, I never measured. So I'm not obsessed with this. Obviously like that just being there is really pissing me off. And I think that th this stuff is gonna be, I'm gonna get a shelf or something because I have this whole little thing which right now is a mess. I think I'm gonna get some kind of shelving thing so I can put my lotions and perfumes in it or on a shelf because that's what I used to have and that way I can like make more room under here and not make it just like products like you know mix and match the I don't know but I just wanted to show y'all what I'm working with for now. Um, it's temporary it's just something light these aren't fully organized yet, but I'm showing you anyways. Okay, I this is like, I didn't even open them before I started filming. This is gonna be my hair stuff. And then this is, you know what? I'm not even gonna show y'all that, so, okay. <clears throat> yeah. Okay, so right here I have this little thing full of pads. This drawer is for my tampons, it's acrylic. In the middle section is my most commonly used hair care, so, yeah, like dry shampoos, um, all that stuff. Some of it's up there because I haven't cleaned. And then these are shampoos, conditioners, and other hair care products. And then down here, 
we gotta work on that. Um, <laughs> but I got rid of a bunch of stuff and that's basically what I was doing. I'd been decluttering and like separating stuff, getting piles, all the PR I'm giving away, stuff like that. So my fridge is actually disgusting right now, but I'm just gonna show you these. Everything else, I literally can't show you right now. You'll, you'll throw up. My pantry needs a lot of work. A lot of work. I haven't even done it. I haven't even started on it. All I've successfully done is this, but stay tuned and I will do a big reveal of the before and after when I work on it. Honestly, my pantry, I'm going to be honest with y'all, like it's not my priority if you can't tell. I don't really eat that many snacks. I live alone and I order out as you know, but I still want to make it cute. It just hasn't been a priority of mine. So I'll show you it when it's done. Don't worry. Literally all of my silverware is in the dishwasher. I'm gonna order another pack of it because I realized I need more. Um, but I ended up using these that I had already had from my old apartment, so I'll link this thing below. It ended up fitting, and I put all my little things in here, and I'm gonna order another pack of them from Potter Pottery Barn, which will be linked below as well. Also, look at this stuff that I got from Amazon. I got this little bowl, and I got these pumpkins, little felt pumpkins that I saw at this store here in Nashville. And they were like $20 like for one of these, so like, 60 total and I was like I know that I could find them on Amazon and I did so I got I have more over there Don't look I'm gonna show you my couch and everything in the next vlog But um, I did find them on Amazon and it, you can pick the colors and stuff and then I got this little bowl on Amazon, too I also got these little pumpkins But I don't have a bowl to put them in yet because my dining table isn't here But it comes this week so in the next vlog you'll see a lot more It'll be cleaner and cuter and prettier it echoes. It's annoying. I'm getting furniture soon I know my videos have been a little like out of whack or whatever, but I'm getting all caught up and just to add on to this one, I'm just gonna add a little unboxing right now. I just got some Revolve gifting in, so I'm gonna open it on camera. <laughs> if you wanna, if you wanna see. I'm out of breath. I need to figure out how to do the air conditioning because it's on 73 right now. That's fucking insane, I need it on 68. <coughs> Wait, this is like a lot of shit. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my, oh my. And there's two pairs of shoes. Slap my fanny. Call me silly. I don't know. Okay, really quick story. The echo is so fucking annoying, I'm sorry. So I don't kill bugs. Um, I feel like, okay, my biggest fear is bugs. Like, I can't, I can't, I can't. I, I get so annoyed when people like are dramatic, but I actually can't deal with bugs. Like right now I'm scared if I'm saying that out loud, they can hear me and they're gonna, Ugh. So I never say that I hate them because I don't wanna offend them. But anyways, so when I say bug, I won't kill it because I feel like it's bad karma. Like I feel like I can't explain that. It's just something is gonna come back and the bug i feel bad like what if there's a soul in there i don't know instead of squishing them i try there's a there's a bug in my cell i don't know what it is because it's so high up i just see a black dot and it's not supposed to be there and it hasn't always been there because i checked the ceilings okay anyways i'm i can't stop thinking about it what if it just ah! what was i saying oh yeah so um what i like to do is put a cup or trap a bug when i see one which when you think about it it's kind of more fucked up because you're literally just making it suffocate and slice and die a slow death. Um, but I literally think squishing is just like evil. Like I will not squish your guts. No, thank you. So I just put a cup and I wait for somebody to come over. No one ever comes over. I live alone. <laughs> so that cup, that cup will stay there. My last apartment didn't have bugs, but my first one, but I mean the one I had before that, I had spiders everywhere and I would just have cups everywhere. So when I, every day I would just dodge my cups and they would stay there for months. Anyways, I have one in the hallway right now and I just pass it and I was just kind of thinking about like how fucked up it is and then in my head I was like well I was wondering what the bug is thinking today like what is going through his head all day long right now just stuck under a dark cup it's not even a cup it's the lid to my medication not much room in there and I was thinking I mean, it's just honestly it hasn't even been that long yet it's been a day so we can really just say that he's in time out okay shut the fuck up I'm gonna open some shit we Okay, that was a lot of unboxing. Let me show you guys these shoes really quick that I got from Ray. I'm usually not into little heels like this, but I'm selling my Princess Polly ones on Poshmark. So I was like, let me get like a nicer pair. Um, these are just like a little baby white. I don't know. I never, like this isn't really my style at all. It used to be last year. I never wear this, but I like just went to a baby shower and this was exactly what I was looking for. And I didn't have like the appropriate shoe for it. Just if I ever have like a situation that pops up like that, now I'll have this little shoe. Cause I usually just wear flats and if I'm wearing a heel, it's huge. There's really no just like kitten heel for me. Except for situations like that when I don't need to be dramatic, which is rare. It's literally a ball. <laughs> yeah, she's cute. Slay through the day. From Ray. Okay, moving on. Oh wait, let me show you I got another pair of shoes. It's from the same brand. 
and these are just for the winter a new white pump because every winter I have to get a new pair because I destroyed mine mine are always so fucking nasty and my other ones I think were just from Amazon so I definitely have upgraded my lifestyle um hope they bet <laughs> oh, OTD, excuse my Bucky's boxers. Okay, so this is just a little um, sweatshirt. I know I'm gonna wanna throw on with like jeans or whatever when it gets colder. Right now it's way too fucking hot for it, but we're transitioning into fall, so I went ahead and got this. Um, my titties are out, but I kind of got this with the idea of like throwing this on on the beach. I'm about to go to the beach for Alex's wedding, and so Walt and I are just gonna be like walking around and stuff. We're staying an extra day, so that's what I envisioned with this. But also if I put boob things on, it's actually not see-through. I thought it would be. I'm sure if it got wet, it would be, but if I put boob things on, this was just, like would be such a cute casual dress because it literally feels like a t-shirt. Love, I l l l love her. This is Tula Rosa and I size down in these. Oh, they're just so comfy. This is the same brand as what the dress I just had on. And it's they're like cute, just running errands dresses because I hate pants, I hate my legs in pants, hate the feeling, I never know how to put an outfit together. So I love dresses and I love ones like this because you can wear them with sneakers or flip flops or whatever. A staple honey 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 i've seen this on the website forever it's a little longer than i'd like um so i don't know how to feel about it but i had no idea that it was like this like colorful on the website it looks like it's just all white but it has like a colorful print in it it's kind of like a baby doll dress i don't know it could be cute if i just figured figured it out played with it a little bit but I don't know, it's a little long for my liking. Big sleigh. This definitely ages me a bit, but I have to remember. What do I have to remember? Not shit. Look at the back. No, it's cute. It's cute. I don't know where the fuck I'm gonna wear it. My hair is just what throws it all off for me. I don't know where I'm gonna wear it. I like little slit. I'm built like a fucking box though. Like, why am I so wide? Excuse my language though. I really wanna start cussing less in my videos. Um, let's get a close up. I think this is for Love and Lemons. Am I right? Am I wrong? Lovers and friends? I always mix those two up, and I don't know why. I actually do. They both have the word love in it, but... Go off! Where are your tits at? God forgot to give you them! <laughs> it's so funny because I used to hate basics, and now I always grab them. I think I got this too big of a size. It's probably because it was cropped, so cropped. When I see the word cropped, it freaks me out, so I always order up. But this is um, a little tea. I wouldn't pair this together. And then these shorts. This is so not my vibe, but like, I'm always trying to branch out of my comfort zone. These are so cute. I wish I could like pull them off. Maybe I can switch things up, hold on. Okay, I would absolutely not pair this together because there's two buckles. I just like, grabbed this because I saw it was white. And then when I put it on, I realized what I was doing and I was like, ew, hell no. This would, these shorts would be really cute with like a bodysuit or like a cropped white tee without a buckle, like something like that. That'd be really cute. Um, and then this is not just like another basic tee that, or basic shirt I got, but then it had this little thing to it. So I can't believe I'm wearing double buckle right now. I mean, God, it should be a big all. This shirt is such my jam. I hate like my shoulders showing and I don't hate it. I just like, I don't know. I, I like not being in a t-shirt, but being like covered up. Can we just like talk about my hair? Like what am, like, am I okay? It's wet. <laughs> Finally. Okay, but this the quality of this material is so good. It's so soft. The pants I just can't get with. They're just not me. They'd be cute on anyone but me. Still be linking them, but yeah. I love basic pieces because I rewear them all the fucking time. Sorry, I'm stop, gonna stop cursing. Slay. Okay, I'm actually obsessed with this. It's low-key like grandma-y. Oh, my titty slip. I think just because I got too big of a size. But if I pinned it in, it would be really cute. I don't know if this brand is new on Revolve or what because I'm just now seeing it for the first time and like lately and I've gotten so many pieces from them. Like in my last um, gifting, I chose all pieces. It's like Anna, Anna Nata, Anna Nata. I don't know how to say it, but it's really just like soft, simple, like cute girly pieces. And I really like it. I should have sized down in this top for sure, but skirts are so in right now. And I love skirts because I hate pants. Um, dresses are just easiest for me because they're already paired together and ain't no stomach showing, but this is flowy. You can tighten it on the back. It's really cool. I don't know. This is so fun to me. I love it. Um, this is kind of iconic. Hello, New Year's. Hello, birthday dress. If you need something, this is perfect. This shit never usually fits me good, like sequins and stuff. It hooks in the back. Ew, I hate my back. I don't even know. I don't even think I showed you. But it hooks in the back, and I don't know. It just actually fit me really well. And usually this shit, like I said, scares me. I'm sweating. I'm sweating. But I love her. How fun. This is a bodysuit, and I'm LOLing because I don't have pants on right now. But it's giving me like princess renaissance vibes, ballet. I'm too hot to go put pants on, but it's cute. We love her, she's really fun. Okay, I also got this really cute denim dress. I'm, I literally am sweating, I can't, I'm starving. I can't do it right now, so. I'm gonna end the vlog off here. Sorry that it was so behind and all combobulated, but I actually have caught up on everything. I know I always say that, but I really did. You, if you follow me on TikTok, you probably can notice that I've been like 
pumping out vlogs. So now that I've got that out of the way, I can focus back on my YouTube. Still doing once a week, but I'm trying to get back to twice a week. And these moving vlogs are gonna be really interesting. I swear, I'm not just saying that. If you're in, if you're like exciting or if you're moving yourself, you can just like hit play and watch it with me because I'm gonna be doing a lot of organization, a lot of ordering furniture and showing it with you all, sharing you my mood boards. And you don't wanna miss it. So make sure you stay tuned. Um, I've already pre-filmed some of it with my mom in town and us shopping um, at like World Market and Target and stuff. I gotta go eat. I need fettuccine Alfredo. I got a lot of update y'all on. <laughs> Love you all. Bye. No.